Okay, I gotta confess. And I'm gonna make it as quick as possible. When Heather started writing her book, I thought to myself, does the way we really eat really affect our body? And can we change the way people think about cooking in the kitchen, tasty, healthy meals to change their life? So I did a little experiment to test the book on my own body of all the stuff that we ate because I wanted to see how I would react to it. So I took 80% of the book and I ate straight out of it. The other 20% I ate at, you know, whether it was Fleming's or Wahoo's or Pickup Sticks or Cheesecake Factory. I modified, but I ate 80% out of the book and 20% the way I normally live. I started this experiment around November 15th and ended it just a few days ago. In the meantime, I went through Thanksgiving, ate whatever I wanted. I went through Christmas, ate whatever I wanted. I went to New, New Year's, ate whatever I wanted. And I went through all those holidays. I exercised no more than 30 to 40 minutes a day, five days a week, in my garage, with no more than the equipment that I had in my garage. No trainer, I wasn't on any special diet, um, I, didn't ha I, I didn't go to a gym for three months. And I was blown away at what happened. I actually had my blood work done December 10th, somewhere around there. Triglycerides, blood pressure, uh, cholesterol, everything perfect. So then, after the holidays, I decided I'm going to check my body fat because this will be the real test. And the last time I checked it was in the middle of summer a year ago when I thought I was in great shape. We had not written the book and I was just doing my own thing and not experimenting or whatever. I was somewhere around 10 and change, I think about 11. I just had it done and it came back at 8.2%, under 10%. I told like three or four people that I was going to get my body fat checked and I said, if I come in anywhere around 10, 11%, I'm totally good. Like I've said before and I preach all the time, we're not about six pack abs and spray on tans like the Jersey people or whatever that show is. We're not like that at all. It was just a result of using the book 80% of the time and doing a little bit of exercise in the garage and it just blew me away how it changed. So my hat's off to my wife for putting our life in this book for you to help you on your journey because this is not a diet. This is not little boxed food or anything like that. This is nothing like that. This is not a diet. It's just a sort of palette for you to follow, to make it your own, and just enjoy life. From our house to your kitchen, we wish you all the mind, body, and spirit in 2014. And remember, life's a journey, not a diet.